Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. Your channel. This is my channel. This is your channel. Girl. Ellery here and the beautiful Yoshi doll. Beautiful times the beautiful, divided by the beautiful, add the beautiful. Okay, all right. Last time we did a huge sushi mukbang. Mm, I can still taste it. And I asked you guys if you guys want us to do it again. And you guys actually, you received it pretty well. I thought, you know, I never know, I never know. But um, this is our second one, and today is obviously, as you read in the title, a crab mukbang. Wow. Usually on Mondays, I let Yoshi pick whatever she wants to eat on Mondays, which yeah. is usually always salmon. Yes, you ask for salmon every Monday. Mondays is usually salmon night. But I'm not gonna have her all week, so since her birthday is a week from today, I decided to give her one of her favorite meals, which is crab legs. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And ginger ale. Ginger! Canada Dry, of course. Sorry I look, oh my gosh. Why well, I look like every day? This is how I usually look around the house. I wanted to get cuter for y'all, but it's a school night. She has tests in the morning and she had acting class. So you know we have to kind of eat expeditiously today in order to get you to bed on time. Get it, got it, good. Make sure you guys subscribe to Yoshi's channel. She has a lot of fun things coming up. And obviously subscribe to mine as well, turn those notifications, Instagram, TikTok, you know it. You know the deal by now. All right, so yes, you're having crab legs, however. Ah. <laughs> it wouldn't be a mukbang if I didn't have you try something new. So we ordered from one of our local crab spots here. And I got her a few things I want her to try that she's never tried before. And one of them is this right here. This is what I think you are smelling that you keep saying smells so good. Can you guess what this is? Soup. I need to smell. All right, so smells really good, but what do you think it is? <gasps> I know. What? It's that crab sauce that's on the crab. No. <laughs> it has to. It smells it's just not, like crab. It's not a sauce. You were close with the soup, but. Crab sauce I'm gonna soup. tell you what it is. In a minute, let me put everything out first. Okay, oh, this is just a salad. I got this for me, because I feel like you're gonna eat all the crab. This is fried. <gasps> Give me that right now. Oh, I'll let you guys smell it. What do you think this is? I already read the box. What is it? Isn't it those meat crab meat fries? No. Huh, oh. you thought you were being sneaky. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you should go back to school because you can't read. <laughs> Just kidding. There is crab fries in there, but these are clearly not crab fries. Hey, it was a guess. This smells I got two things that are <gasps> Wait, fried. is it calamari? No. I didn't get calamari because I know you like calamari. Why? You called me stuff I liked in the last video. I got you stuff you liked in this video too. What's that? Oh, you really don't know what these are. Potatoes. No. What? So, smell them. Do you think they smell good? They smell like nothing. <laughs> well, they don't. They do smell good. They smell sweet. And I think this is the last thing in a box. Crab. The crab fries, you know, be right. I want it. They look better in the picture, but maybe because I have to put the sauce I, on it. I this thought, is the sauce that comes with it right here. I thought they were like crab meat in that the is, shape of a fry. Oh wow, that's fancy. No, it's crab meat on top of a regular tater fry. I want it. And last but not least, the crab. Ay! Why is it black? <laughs> There's crab and other stuff in here as well. Oh my. So let me show you guys all the stuff we have here today, Chef. They only gave us one bit. Oh. It's all right, I'm an adult. Over here we have, you've had regular oysters before, right? So you've had them raw. These are fried oysters. Wow. They look nothing like the raw oysters. Because they're fried. But they're, they're usually in a clam. You like can't whole. fry the shell. The, can I finish? Then right here we have fried plantains. What plantains. That? Plantains <gasps> or plantains, I don't know how to say it, but what? Like plant, like plantain with SpongeBob. You got so excited over that. That's weird. Anyways. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Then we have some crab fries. I don't know what the sauce is, but I'm assuming you're supposed to pour it on top. Isn't it yum yum sauce? Mm, I don't think it'll put yum yum sauce in this. Let me smell it. It kind of smells like yum yum sauce. All right, so yeah, that I'm should be smart. good. This, which you didn't know, this is called seafood gumbo. 
Oh, I saw that on the box. I did not think that was it. I have to mix it because I'm assuming the seafood is underneath all that broth. That's but it smells it good, so we'll see how that tastes. Obviously, that's just a basic salad. Then here in our bag, we have black mussels. Then we have some crawfish. I've never had crawfish before. You've never had crab? Crawfish. Did I say crab or crawfish? Come on now. What's crawfish? It's a crawl that fishes. I don't know. <laughs> what? Then we got Dungeness crab, and we have obviously your corn and your potato. Okay? How, how do you tell the difference? Of what? Between the crabs. They look different. They have some of them. See how these are way bigger legs than you normally get? Mm -hmm. That's because it's a different type of crab. Okay, let's see it already. All right, so you want to try the fried oyster first? I'm going to order. Okay. Want to cheers it? That was warm. Well, we listen, we had to drive home, jeez. Oh, it was warm? Yes. Oh. All right, you ready, cheers? <laughs> this is actually fire. Can you finish the one you have first? No. Jeez. Ooh, that salt is blessing, blessing. <laughs> and I usually don't like fried oysters. Those are fire. One out of one. Oh, wait, we need to rate everything. <laughs> this gets a 9.5 out of 10. Wow, you're very picky. I'm giving it a 10. I can eat these all day, put them in a little bag. Oyster chips. Mm. I changed my mind, it's a 10 out of 10. I knew it, I knew it. You ain't gotta be shy, sis. I probably, you don't worry. You gotta try everything else. Yeah. You can't just eat all those. I was actually hoping you wouldn't like those. Oh, wow. <laughs> But finish what you have in your mouth because this is a whole different okay. flavor. Oh, well, it's stuck, stuck in my teeth. Ooh, you gotta do all that. <laughs> These are also hit or misses for me. These are like, um, correct me if I'm wrong, okay? These are like bananas. What the flip? Don't say that because you know I don't like when you say that. It sounds too much like you want to say something else. And I don't see what's wrong with me saying they're like bananas. Like, what is that? What the flip? What? That was so unnecessary. How is it like bananas? It's seafood. They're like sweeter bananas or something like that. Somebody in the comments correct me because I know I'm probably wrong. One, two, three. You can taste the banana. Do you have to smack like that though? You don't like it? Six out of ten. Nobody wants to see what's in your mouth, bro. See, you know what? Six out of ten. I ain't raised her like this. And I don't want to finish it. Really? Six out of ten. Take it. What is it? Too sweet for you? Yes, I hate sweet food. Do you now? Unless it's candy. And dessert? Yes. And pie and cookies, so you don't hate sweet food. I don't, just... like, so I don't like like food food that's sweet. Man. Yeah. It's the model of me. That doesn't even make sense. <laughs> you just don't like this, because desserts are food. Okay, this is gonna be my favorite. Just let me eat it. Can you wait? We gotta put the sauce, put the sauce at least in this corner. I dip it. How do I do this? Get it fried as such. You stab a little bit of the crab meat as such. And if you want to dip it, you can try it without the dip first, but I'm going to dip mine because I like my stuff saucy. You should have dipped it, sis. Wait, and he should try it the dip first. Why didn't you just use the fork? I don't know. I swear I didn't raise her like this. She's, she's very strange. Do you like it or not? 9.8 out of 10. 9.8, really? What's the point two? Why did you make it miss point two? Hey, you don't judge me on my judging. You don't judge me on my judging. Oh my gosh. You're like giving me preteen vibes and I don't like it. My child is 10. She's about to be a whole teenager. She's about to be in a whole junior high school. Not no. next year, but the year after. Never. Never what? Never. Never what? I don't want to leave elementary. You don't want to grow up? You're a Toys R Us kid? I will, I, no one wants to grow up. Mm, you sure do try to act like you grow. She's just kidding. No, she's not. This is the seafood gumbo. Do we have a spoon? I got you a spoon right here. Relax. Okay. Where's my wink? Oh. <laughs> okay, see all the seafood is down here. That does not look like seafood. That's hard to show, obviously, because it's on the spill, but. I see shrimp, that looks like a little sausage. Can't eat sausage. Crab meat, rice, smells really good. I can't eat sausage. Don't eat the sausage then, common sense. Take, a take the spoonful and 
then don't put the sausage on it. Like, I'm so confused why you, that didn't make sense to you. Like, bro. Excuse me. I, I can't. <laughs> You're acting like a barbarian. <laughs> Try the dang seafood gumbo, please. This needs to be something stronger than ginger ale. I'm giving it an 8.5 an 8 out of 10. It's a little spicy. You've only tried the liquid. You didn't even try the, the shrimp. You didn't try the rice. I didn't get didn't that on my spoon. Then scoop. It wasn't scoop, meant to baby, be. Scoop, baby, scoop. It wasn't meant to be. Just try one sausage. It's not gonna kill no. you. She's really this. taking this pescatarian thing to heart. I, I admire it, but like, you're not gonna die. Fine, I'll do it at 8.6 out of 10. Would you like the shrimp? It's shrimp. What, so? what do you think? Shrimp tastes different sometimes. Oh, no, just because you had more, I get to have them. Do you, sis? Ain't nobody else coming, unfortunately. Let me open our foil bag. Let's start off easy. Try one of these mussels. This sauce that we have here today, chef, is lemon pepper, garlic butter. I know you like lemon pepper. I know you like garlic. I know you like butter. Why is it hairy? I know, it looks gross. It's so alive. is this, look at it, the crab is hairy too. Cause what is crab hairy? When it's dungeness. Mmm, all good. All right, so I'm putting a little bit of the sauce on the we, muscle. We might need some of that for my birthday. <laughs> I'll get you a special birthday meal. Yeah. All right, so here's yours. You just take it out kind of just like an oyster. You gonna eat it without me? Can you cover your mouth when you burp, bro? You are not a boy. You gonna eat it without me? Rude. Jeez. No, you burping <laughs> is rude. Very chewy. Has a lot of flavor. Juice is pretty nice. It's a hint of spice. But I'll give it a 10 out of 10. 10? Oh, wow. Mm, it's so good. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Miss Diva? I did not know the crawfish is like still in crawfish form. Like it looked like it's alive. What do you mean? What? Oh, I don't know if I can eat this one. <laughs> I'll eat it. I'll eat it. Give pick it, it up. Pick it up. I don't even know how to open it. But it's not like. <laughs> don't even look like it's like. They didn't no. want to take the head off. <laughs> Oh, cut it off. Oh God, oh my God. <laughs> no. It's dead, it's dead. I gotta be a good example. It's dead. Be a man, be a man. <laughs> be a woman. Exactly. Uh. <sighs> oh my God. <laughs> I'm so scared. I think I just break the tail off, right? I don't know. We probably should Google it. Google it. How do you eat a crawfish? Hey Siri, how do you eat a clawfish? It's crawfish, it's not alive. Oh look, I pulled the tail off. Look, I think this is like the meat. That is terrifying. Wait, no, cause how do you get it out the tail? This isn't supposed to be difficult. Oh look. Gimme. Dip it in the uh, sauce. Not that, the butter sauce, weirdo. Where's the butter sauce? In here. I don't want it in here. He's really not himself anymore. 10 out of 10. 10? If it didn't have the head, but 10 out of 10. Well, you breaking the next one. Why? What do you mean why? Because <laughs> I, am, I am eating too. And I haven't even tasted it yet. Wait, this one don't look, why does it look like that? It's just diarrhea. Don't say that, because it does look like that. Why would you say that? And I'm about to see. I'm not eating that part. <laughs> I gotta make sure it's supposed to be that yellow color. These are hard. Unless I'm not doing it right, which I'm sure I'm not. I hope y'all aren't judging me right now. I know crawfish is like a popular fish. Uh, excuse me. I covered my mouth. So let me get you a leg. I think you're gonna like Dungeon's Crab better than your the normal crab you get. Oh, normal, I'll be the judge of that. The normal crab you get never has enough meat for you. You always like, this little piece of meat. This one has the meat. Right. Wait, Crab Hut, we have the meat. Don't sue us, Arby's. How do I open this? I'm not. You should know how to open crab by now, as much as we've done had it. 
I done gave you several tutorials. All right, let me open this. Look at all this meat you left in here. That's all crab meat, ma'am. This is why I don't buy you expensive dinners, bro. You leaving money on the table. Can you taste the meat now? Yes. Exactly. I want more. Mm, I'm hearing a 10 out of 10 coming. Bring me the fire! Oh, love the fire! What was that? The song I made up within the last two seconds. Oh my god. I'm gonna send you to etiquette class. That's what daddy said. He ain't got no etiquette either. Ooh. I'm gonna give, tell you one more time how to eat the crab, okay? Don't example on that, that's what I'm eating. I'm not doing it. Okay. <laughs> you break off this, pull it out. Okay. You break this joint right here, take it off. And then you're gonna have this part right here. This part, you just crack open so that you can pull up the shell apart. That should be a whole schlick of meat. Schlick. Break off this one, bite it, crack it, slick of meat. And then this is where your yeah. yeah. thunder thigh meat gonna be. Sounds like an ASMR. I want right. a little beatbox. We should do a, a mukbang ASMR, but you might get on my nerves, cause you be getting on my nerves when it's time to eat. That's what ASMR is, eating with you. Yeah, I'm not doing that. <laughs> mm -mm. You drive me crazy. Here you go. Okay, so we break this. Oh, I didn't even try the gumbo. You did? Mm -mm. Did I? I don't know. Auntie Miles gumbo is better. I've never tried that. Well, they got okra in here too. Oh, ain't nothing like that good Canada dry 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 Is there anything in here? I'm looking at it, so I don't see how you don't see it. Bam. So. Last video, when we did our mukbang, we talked about what we were trying to plan to do for Yoshi's birthday, and we didn't have a clear vision yet. Oh, wait, I haven't even got it out and I already see it. Excited much? Jeez. Dip it in the butter, sis. Dip it in the butter. We all see this. <laughs> Not looks too like, much butter, though, just halfway, because the butter like, is really fattening. Looks like new money, new money. <laughs> Your face look like dirty money. <laughs> Mine probably do too though. As I was saying, we finally decided on a birthday theme and it's kind of all over the place right now because we plan for it to be indoors because sometimes it rains on her birthday. Atlanta weather is bipolar. Some years it's rained on her birthday, other years it hasn't. But it's not looking like it's raining at all this weekend. So now my theme got a little messed up. It was supposed to be like a, how do I explain it? Like Yoshi Doll's award show, like a award show theme where everybody comes as celebrities and she performs. You guys don't know, but she has like a couple songs that she learned that I wrote. <laughs> Give me my flowers. Just kidding. Not really though. Um, so she's gonna do a little performance. She has a song with her sister. It was just supposed to be like a fancy lunch, basically. But now that it's not raining, who wants to be inside? <laughs> so now we gotta figure out how to make it indoors, outdoors, because obviously people are gonna wanna swim. Who's gonna wanna swim? Y'all never get in the water. The lies, yes we do. Please, we can't get through one pool day without us trying to get y'all to get in the water. What? Listen, it's been cold. Dipping your feet in doesn't count. It's been cold, but now that it's actual pool weather, not just one cool day out the week, I'm getting in. If you don't get in, you owe me Robux. I don't owe you nothing, okay? I kinda want Robux for my birthday. You owe me. How about that? And I'm not getting you nothing else for your birthday, bro. Robux! This party is expensive enough. Robux! Ask somebody else. Robux! I'm fresh out. Who else am I supposed to ask? You have plenty of family and friends. TT gets me clothes. And I asked Chelsea. Why are you eating like this? <laughs> Good thing we're not having the fancy lunch anymore. You're supposed to be the celebrity guest and you're over here eating like you're in prison. Anyways, still should be a good time. If you wanna get a sneak peek at some of the stuff we have or that we're getting ready for her party, check out her video tomorrow. I'm not really feeling this crap crawfish. Still eating that? I tried to try one more, but I'm not feeling like the yellow color inside. The tail is pretty good. It's too hard. I need to watch a tutorial next time I try to eat crawfish because Yoshi also has a lot of surprises she doesn't know about. What? At a birthday party. That no. was just party and 
Six when have I ever not surprised you on your birthday? Please tell me. When we went to, what was it called? That trampoline place? We was in Sky Zone. When did we go to a trampoline place on your birthday? We went to Sky Zone for my like fourth birthday. Okay, you were like three or four, maybe. You were four, you were three. I don't remember. You but just the didn't point remember is, it and you're correcting me? The point is, you had never been there before, so it was still a surprise. And why are you trying to discredit the fact that I don't surprise you every year on your birthday? I don't know, I was just trying to find something. Even your fifth birthday, you were at the pool, but you didn't know that Annie was coming. You didn't know you were getting that nice, fancy cake. That'd be a nice surprise. You didn't know it was My Little Pony themed. You didn't know that you were having a surprise party at Great Whip Lodge. Then last year, obviously, you didn't know you were having a surprise party either. That one actually got me. You know what? I go out of my way to give you birthday experiences. I just said it got me. Why are you? You said that, that one. Like that was the only time you were surprised. Do I never said that? Well, you know what? Maybe I just won't surprise you. Okay. I won't surprise. How do you feel about turning ten? It's gonna be amazing. Double digits. I thought you just said no. You didn't want to get older. Why are you remembering everything I say? I'm just saying. You just said it. That was at the beginning of the video. It's like 10 minutes ago. No, it wasn't. Rewind the video and look at it. Anyways, so you are looking forward to getting older. I'm looking forward to get 10, not getting older. So how would you rate this meal overall? Now you gotta compare it to the first one. Want me to add it up? No. Uh, I would say only a million at a time. A million? Compared to the sushi? Sushi. I think it's probably the same. Mm -mm, you gotta pick one. Why? So if you have to do one again, again, which one would you do? It would definitely be the sushi if I didn't have this. You like this more than everything? Yeah. Mm. Put this on my checklist. I need some of this for my birthday, dude. This is gonna be the main meal. So it's actually feeling a little embarrassing eating this. Honestly, we are a hot mess. We look like savages. Like there savage. is butter dripping in all the crevice and creations. She's acting like a small little boy who's never had crab before. And um, I'm ashamed. I'm ashamed that I am recording this catastrophe. Y'all, Crab Hug got that season in blessing, blessing! Sheesh! <laughs> what was that last part? Wait, what does this mean? Sheesh! That better just be, that's just like a dance move. Do you know what you're doing when you're doing that? I mean, I'm saying, Sheesh! You gotta get off TikTok, bro. You need to get up to date, bro. <laughs> Actually, over the weekend, I met a lot of young people, and they all, every time I said I was 35, they were all like, dang. Like, I really felt old this weekend. It's the first time going out, I felt old. They all thought your mom was ancient. So did I. That's nice. <laughs> that means you look young. But you think I'm ancient? Doesn't ancient just mean you're young, but you're old? <laughs> ancient means you're you're old, you're ancient, your you're, you're history. Oh, I thought it meant like you're pretty, but you're old. So you think I'm old? Dude! Oh, by the way, you should owe me $10. I totally forgot about that. You All right. Got, you almost so. got free. You almost got free. <laughs> Thank you guys for No, don't end it, don't end it, don't end it. Why, we gotta go. No, we don't. What do you have to do? Eat. They don't need to see no more. You are disgusting, everybody. Anyways, I'm embarrassed, so we gotta go. Thank you guys for watching our video. Please let me know. If you would like us to do another one, I don't know who would at this point. Um, Look at the Chinese. Oof, that sounds like my stomach gonna hurt. Or Mexican. We'll let them decide, because they can write comments on my video. So leave a comment and let us know any other mukbangs that uh, you might want to see. As you know already, we've done sushi and crab. I don't know what to do after this. Let me know. Or we could do only gummy food. No. Or only sour food. No. Or almost uh, only spicy food. No. Girl, you can't even eat a piece of and, soup and with spice. And the challenge will be whoever drinks the least amount of food. You can do that with your sister. I'm, I'm out. I'm fresh out. Mm -hmm. Okay? Ugh. I covered my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Call me how many times I've burped. 
let's not. Yes. Like, Jesus. Like, you're, you're embarrassing me at this point. As I was about to say, until next time, I love ya. Mwah. I'm gonna eat all this food. I'm so embarrassing. All right.